sun is about to go down So what you doing tonight? What's up guys? Today is a bit of a special day um, As you can see Leaving the parents house now Where is the XF going? Um, yeah, we're taking it somewhere and you're about to find out so stay tuned guys so i said i was taking excess somewhere and we are here where's he you say this is here mine and bo's new house so for you that don't know bo's my cousin um and bo and i also started let loose racing together you'll also notice that we've changed the channel name to let loose racing rather than just having my name as well so we have everything under the one banner so where's the excess she's in there I finally have my very own garage to work on my own car. I don't have to worry about getting in my brother's and my dad's way and and yeah. So for now, it's just just the XF in here. Um, eventually, Bo's car will be here too, which is a race car build as well. Um, we'll show that a bit later. But yeah, for now, just the XF in the center. Um, we just got the floors all done for like a month now. And yeah, it's it's pretty good. It's been pretty, uh, pretty cruisy so far. Um, I brought this here about, I think we were two weeks we were in the house, so yeah, I was so stoked to have this here now. It actually feels like a house. I'm so excited to um to be able to work on my own car in my own garage. I've got my own toolbox, which I got for my 30th birthday, which was a couple of weeks ago. Um, started filling it up with some tools and whatnot, so yeah, I'm excited to get some of this stuff dirty and start using it, start working on the XF, but yeah, exciting times ahead. Um, obviously, the garage isn't finished yet there's we're still gonna put some cabinetry across here uh some cabinets across the top here there'll be a tv in the middle or supercars and whatnot we can obviously watch that in here while working on the race car so yeah also I'm, i've seen a few things on pinterest where people put storage above the roll door here so that might be something as well as well but um yeah for now this is where everything's gonna be getting done on the xf all the updates and whatnot we're gonna to do to it finishing it off is gonna be done from this garage. Um, yeah, I, I'm so so excited to start making some cool content for you guys. I've got some pretty good ideas. It's not the biggest space, it's a standard two size garage. It'll do the job. It'll work perfect for what we need to do for now. Um, we're probably gonna to upgrade to something a little bit bigger eventually. So Bo, both Bo and I have a couple of different projects in mind. Obviously Bo's gonna start building his XR6 Turbo race car build, which in a two car garage with one race car already in here. It's gonna be a little bit tough. So yeah, we'll probably start doing a build of Bo's, cars he Bo's car here. Um, obviously I'll finish off my car, get it ready for the next track day here as well. And then we have a little bit of a plan for getting ourselves a little bit more uh, a little bit more space, which we probably do need. So, but yeah, um, as I said, the XF is it's pretty much ready to go uh, to the track. It's got a couple little things which I'll show you. Um, still left over to do. I still need to, oh, that window is filthy. Obviously need to give it a clean. Um, need to top up the gearbox. Need to cut the shifter out just a little bit here so it stops the, um, the front shifter bolts just foul here really bad and it, it's bloody annoying. It rattles my ears off when it's in the car. Um, so yeah, just need to cut that a little bit more. I've got a custom surround that goes on that. I wouldn't mind cleaning up some of my wiring a little bit more. Um, and just, just a couple little bits. Oh, I still need to. There's another little project here, but you'll see some of that later. Still need to fix the um, the hangers for the rear of the floor so this thing doesn't fall off again like it did at uh, Geelong Revival. So, but yeah, there's there's not a huge amount to do. Oh, one of my biggest things I want to do, I want to get a little bit more offset in the rear here. Just want to get it out to the guard just that little bit more. Obviously, stance and offset and whatnot is something pretty important to me. But yeah, so pumped to have my own shed. Um, so excited to start doing some some updates and some of the changes that I want to do to the XF. I'm so pumped to show you guys that and get it ready. I'm not sure when the next track day is going to be. Um, obviously, with the whole COVID stuff, it's kind of put everything on the back burner a little bit. And obviously, having moved into a new house, there's heaps of stuff we need to do. For example, I don't even have a driveway yet. Um, me and Bar haven't done any landscaping yet. But yeah, we're going to start getting cracking on that stuff. Get the exhaust everything mounted on that get it started and actually make sure that the 
flywheel chain just got rid of the little engine vibration that we've had and yeah get tack on that but there's one other thing i want to show you about this house that i'm super excited about um there's going to be some mad content coming from here obviously working on the car but something else in this house is going to be heaps of content coming from so i'll show you guys that now don't know if i was more excited to get the house to have my car in the house or have my car in a garage at the house or for this Oh, you can tell two guys live here, obviously. Keep me rocking and F1 helmets are sitting there. But yeah, obviously, nothing's done out the back. We haven't even got the TV cabinet in yet. Um, we've got the fundamental set up, so we're getting there. But one of the main things, one of the first things we got set up, dun, 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 is the simulator. The both Bo and I are super excited to get into and get using a hell of a lot more than we have been. Um, there's a few changes we're going to make. We're going to go to a direct drive setup. We're going to change the pedal setup. And we might even change to an Ultra 49 uh, wide monitor. Um, but yeah, I, we're probably going to try and make like weekly content on here. Both doing just different challenges. Anything like if there's an F1 weekend on, trying to beat the quality time or the lap record for that track. To reviewing cars, reviewing different sims and whatnot. Different products. And yeah, this is, this is going to be something we're going to try to do every week to every fortnight um there's so much stuff to show you so I'll shoot you guys on here there's so many different forms of racing and and whatnot you can do um and we really want to show it off and we, we've got a pretty good idea of how we're going to do it and i reckon you guys will like it a lot but yeah that's another project we still need to finish that stuff off and yeah like i said having this new house it's it's a working project we don't have blinds yet there's yeah there's lots we still need to do but it'll start happening pretty quick but for now Little bits and pieces that I do this thing, I'm gonna start getting done. Um, I'm gonna show you guys all that stuff. I've got a little bit of a different theory on how I'm gonna do some of my filming and recording and whatnot. Um, yeah, I I'm excited. So stay tuned, guys. We've got some cool stuff coming. I am so excited about this. One last thing, guys, I forgot to mention. Um, we chose this house because it has an amazing view. You've got to see it for yourself. Look at that. What are the hats for the view like that? Alright guys, enough of that. Catch you guys next time. Cheers. So we can meet in one in style. Yeah. Slow more down. Sun is about to go down. So what you doing tonight? It's everything I can't think of. Waking up a new